<laughs> we literally just stopped it. We watched it live on Twitch. A BS underscore reviews at twitchtv.com or twitch.tv slash BS underscore reviews. We just finished it. Go ahead, S. Well, you asshole didn't wait for me because you even suggested we watch it live I together. Did. I completely forgot. Wait. Okay, I completely um. forgot. But after I saw it, I was like, and I got emotional. I watched the ending like five times, and then I said, we're still watching this tonight. I know you're having issues processing this. Um, first of all, I, I do want to say okay. I oh, told oh, you. Tote, tote five, we, we just finished watching it live together. So she, we're about to give our review of the episode seven. So I apologize, but go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead, S. Um, well, I, I knew that um, characters would be coming back. We were meeting like one character in episode and I'm like, there's a reason for this. We're gonna meet him again. And even the robot that was dead, I was like, he's coming back. Somebody's gonna rebuild him and he's gonna come back. And he did, and I told you, ha. Um, I'm happy to see the girl again. I don't know why people are complaining about her. I love her, I think she's awesome. I think she is kick-ass straightforward and there's no like bullshit fake forced romance story. It's yeah. just straightforward. Um, um, I, the whole episode was building up to this, like you knew it was a trap. He gets the invite from an old rival, which was the guy from the first episode that gave him the job in the first place, which I called that too. And we know it's a trap. He gets there, but then the guy gets hurt with Daenerys dragons came out of somewhere. Does, does it make you feel better that all the episodes we called like filler episodes and side quests, they actually weren't now that you have hindsight of kind of learning that was those people and their story and everything behind them. There's a reason yes, to actually get it, attached to the character. It makes more sense that you, all of these episodes focused on one new character um, and their story so that you would be a little bit more attached to them. Um, so I'm glad that, that we, we got that Agreed. time with the characters. Um, it, it made me appreciate the former episodes more. Yes, it did. Um, <laughs> so we know it's a trap. He gets there and then they're like camping out before they go and try to kill the guy that originally wants to steal the baby Yoda. Yeah. And the, his old friend rival gets hurt and little green saves him. <laughs> and yeah, like he's exhausted from it. He like collapses and everything, and yeah. you're just like, ah. Um, but he did it because he's he's little green. He's a good guy. Well, before and... you go any further, remember prior to that, the death grip. He did a force choke. Oh my god! Yes, I forgot about that. Oh my god! He thought that the girl when they were doing their like um, arm wrestling, yep. he thought that he was like hurt, he uh, she was hurting him, mm -hmm. and he just like Darth Vader that shit. And I'm like, what is he doing? <laughs> but what's interesting is nobody knows what he is or why he's special mm -hmm. or they haven't even mentioned the force yet like i was expecting the the old guy to be like oh i've heard of this this is called the force well he did say there um, were rumors of it in the there empire were rumors mm -hmm. yes but he never said the word right um because it's been you know uh because like Yoda was in hiding for so long that that his species and everything people aren't familiar with, yep. and and even the Force is is has been a myth for so long. Oh, he was in hiding for twenty years. Yeah, yeah, um, and so so yeah, he heals the guy, mm -hmm. and so the guy, you know, can't go through with the plan. Um, which he does have a heart. <laughs> yeah. Mando um, tried to shoot it, but he has a heart. Yeah, yeah. And and you get into town. I really like seeing all the different stormtroopers, like the different style stormtroopers that we've seen throughout multiple You can tell those movies. are like displaced. They're almost like gypsies. They're wanderers yeah. trying to be able to be guns for hire. But mm -hmm. the other ones later on, they are. They're part of still a core. Yeah. But go ahead and continue. Yeah. I don't want to jump. <laughs> um... So they get into to town, you know, and Little Green isn't with them because they're like, it's not going to be safe. So definitely don't take him with us. And so this is the, or um, this I have is spoken the guy. Yeah, I have spoken guy takes Little Green and, and traveling back to the ship and, uh -huh. and they go into town and I'm sitting there and I'm like, and they're sitting at the round table and I'm like waiting for him to get his blast. And I'm like, he's going to shoot him under the table like Han. This yeah. is going to be great. Like, so happy here. 
And then, he, then you're like, oh, he gets a call. Okay. And as soon as I see that guy, like I know that actor, I forget yep. his name. He's always a bad guy. Like, <laughs> always a bad guy. Right. No matter what he's in. So I knew, obviously, he's he's a bad guy. Dunn Dun did the same, the, the <sighs> shock trooper. She did the exact same reaction I had. She goes, who's this guy? Yeah. <laughs> I was like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> Go ahead. Um, but we knew, you know, it wasn't just this one guy that was hired to find Little Green. We knew he was part of a larger organization, a larger team, um, a larger right. plan. We just don't know what that is. And so when this guy shows up with not just more power, more firearm, more power, more control, more organization, like, like you said, these stormtroopers that come in are not all dirty and like working to just, you know, side jobs or whatever. These are yeah. the... This is like this is what it looks like the new the the order, um, and this is probably the start of it. Like I said, I was like I swear the the collapsed pieces of the empire end up becoming the order right. for episode seven, eight, and nine, um, and they just take out all their people in there and and ah, uh, so uh, what's his name or yeah, it's going back to the ship with Little Quill. Green. Yes, Quill is like trying to get back to the ship, and I'm thinking, okay, Tiger would take his robot. Will come out. Yeah, with and the make door sure coming that... down and everything yes. like that. I'm like, okay, we're we're gonna we're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. And then they pan away, and Little Green's laying on the ground. I'm like, first Ooh. reaction I had was, that's not Little Green. Maybe he threw a decoy down. Yeah, that's my thought too. <laughs> and I'm like, come on, that's that's not Little Green, right? And then the like, calm. Oh. And then, and then, then you see his lifeless out. body and the blurb with the white eyes rolled back on him, and he he, he got you see smoke coming out of him. He got gunned down. He did. Like they, they I, miss all the time. Why do they suddenly get their shot right now? Um, they like, weren't shooting uh, blasters. They were shooting from their speeders. Uh, <laughs> that, um, that hit me hard. I was like. Are you fucking kidding me? Did they just do that? Did they just like kill him and I gotta go a week and a half to? I mean, he's he's dead. There's no yeah. way they're no, bringing him back. There, he is gone. Nope, he's gone. He's gone, and they're trapped. And and unless the robot left the ship and is going to back him up and everything, I don't. It's kind of hard to see how they're gonna get out of this one. I bet the and droid says I, it's made to protect him. When the ship was coming down, it saw him get gunned down and is now making its way to town. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Um, so maybe, I don't know. Um, I will say that um, you had predicted like this was going to set up something for, for episode nine. I think it's something with the cloning of Palpatine, yes. Yeah, but <clears throat> it didn't set up anything for episode nine. Like episode nine comes, like technically they've already had the premiere and everything, but we're going yep. to see episode. You're seeing it tomorrow, and we're we're seeing it as a family on Friday. Yep. And doing our review on Saturday with our other sister, and I've been bragging about being pretty right the entire time, and I may be completely wrong, but <laughs> I still think if uh, I still think something's gonna tie. I don't think it's gonna be massive because yeah, uh, because this takes uh, place so. Like, this takes place right after episode six, you know? I, like, I liked that character that got gunned down in the streets after yeah. three lifetimes, human lifetimes, of servitude. Did you say two or three? He said three lifetimes of human, uh, human lifetimes of servitude to work to not serve anybody else. And he wanted to do it to oh. protect the co kid. And I liked his character before I liked I anybody else in this entire series. You did. And you did. that... I've spoken. Yeah. I've spoken. And I'm pretty sure if you rewatch the VOD for, of us watching this, you can see me get tears in my eyes. I smile when I cry because I'm a fucking <laughs> weirdo, but I, I, that hurt me. That fucking hurt. Yeah, it was, it was sad. Like that was, that was a character that you, you know, you, you did, you just liked instantly. Mm -hmm. Um, and, and you didn't really, you didn't see him every episode. I mean, there's, there's only been seven episodes, but we got him for two episodes, and you still have an emotional attachment to him. Yeah. Um, and, well, technically, I guess... Three. Technically, we got him for three episodes, yeah. yeah. Um, but, yeah, that was hard to see. And now they have Little Green. And we only have one episode left. Yeah. Um, we have Star Wars this weekend, and then we have, uh, and then we have one episode of Mandalorian left, and then, then we're going to be waiting a... 
probably a year until we get new episodes. I haven't. Uh, this may be a spoiler. I heard something through the grapevine that Little Green is not in season two. But that was something I heard through the you, grapevine. You think they might change that now? With yes. how popular he's been? I think they could uh, very much do little, that. There's Little Green memes everywhere. And I'm I'll be honest with you. I can't see them killing off Little Green. No. Maybe him vanishing or something, and the next season is about them tracking down and trying to get him back uh, for yeah. whatever it is. Um, but they originally said it doesn't matter if he's dead or alive. They just needed what they wanted out of him. Um, if if they don't have him in season two on there, then I don't think they'll kill him off after having that much of a drastic death at the end of this episode. Right, so right. If they, I don't if, think so if, yeah, so I don't think Little Green's going to die. I think right. he will either vanish and, and you'll never see him again, or uh, it'll be like season two is about tracking him down, or what? it's a different story with the Mando about going after this guy will be the ep villain of episode, uh, yeah, yeah, season yeah. two. Who, we still don't know who's been tracking him. In the last episode, at the very end, we know somebody's tracking him. What if it was Maybe him? that. Maybe it was him, but he doesn't seem like a boots on the guy, boots on the ground kind of guy. Like he sent in all those stormtroopers before he landed himself. I agree. So he's, he's. I don't think he's the one tracking him. So maybe this other person that's been following them will help save them in this situation for the next episode. I don't know. I don't know. I I have to say though, this is probably the best Star Wars feeling I've had in a long yeah. time. Yeah, um, it was it was very well done. Like literally, just finished watching it seconds before we started this, and it was it was a good episode. Like there's, it it went by very fast. <laughs> um, like it was it was one of the longer ones. It was like forty two minutes or something, but it yeah. went by very fast. <laughs> um, but I I mean I I enjoyed it. <laughs> I didn't have any issues with it. Was I um, right saying that was probably one of your favorite episodes? With the threads coming together for once? Yeah, yeah. I liked the multiple stories mm -hmm. coming together and and leading into something else. Um, God, I'm so sad that he died. 